<laughs> Still alive, just about a month. It don't look like somebody that's just about to alive. In Irish politics, constituency work is essential. I have done the same clinics for 35 years, and you simply must do that. You won't be a legislator, you won't be a minister uh, if you don't look after the constituency. I recall um, Roy Jenkins saying to me once that no month ever went by that he didn't visit his constituency once. If I did that, I'd be out of a job. What's the volume? Well, I grew up in Mayo, typical uh, West of Ireland farming background. Uh, I suppose in one sense, pretty idyllic childhood, but a very frugal environment where every home was affected by immigration. And uh, I suppose that left a mark on me, really. Galway was a fantastic liberation. Uh, like most of uh, the students of the time, I think I was first generation university. Uh, the world was young, uh, youth culture was emerging for the first time, young people had a voice. Uh, I think the issues uh, were such that uh, most people, if not politicised, were interested in public affairs that time. Three successive summers in the United States really had a profound impact on me. The country was rent in two. It wasn't just the civil rights movement and the Martin Luther King leadership but it was the Vietnam War. On my way back, I confronted the pictures from uh, Northern Ireland. You know, it seemed they were imitating developments in the United States, and um, it really was a character forming, as far as I was concerned. Well, I really couldn't have imagined myself uh, other than in politics and being immersed in, in public affairs. I enjoyed the cut and thrust in the doyle, uh, I enjoyed uh, being a legislator. I more enjoyed being a minister where you could actually cause things to be done. But uh, the ups and downs of politics, it's a roller coaster existence. Uh, but I wouldn't do anything else. Well, every time you walk through the gates of Dolan, it's I, I, certainly I was always conscious of what a privilege it was to have been elected uh, by the people to represent them in Dali. Yeah, it can be intrusive on occasions. It's tough in family life, uh, but th there's tremendous self-satisfaction. And the notion of public service that you can actually influence events around you, have some say in the direction the country goes, uh, and so on, is uh, a tremendous boost. For a child of the 60s, I, I think politics is something of an addiction, and you can't break the cord entirely uh, and for that reason I'm glad that I have the opportunity to write a column for the Sunday Business Post. Uh, it uh, keeps my hand in, it keeps me interested in public affairs uh, and I get, uh, I get great pleasure from that. Uh, it's interesting to be able to <coughs> sit back and, uh, and comment on what you see happening as distinct from being a player.